This is Tom from 2 Cave Aquatics. I made a video a couple days ago, two days ago, on my 20 gallon tall tank here. And I got quite a few, well over 100 views in two days. So I thought that was great. I thought I'd make another video again today. Uh, this is a 20 gallon tall tank. And you can see one of my blue uh, neon stiffenon gobies is up here. I have two of them in. They were just both up here playing a second ago. And the new algae, I mean the new uh, angel fish. She's really pretty. And my uh, golden algae eater here. She loves this little statue I made with these rocks. She's constantly gazing up at that face. <laughs> She's sitting here waiting for her algae tabs. She's like a puppy with her bones. So I'm gonna try to drop uh, a couple algae tabs in there. She's gonna go right for them. And the angelfish will come down and eat some of the algae too. Up those algae tabs. But once that uh, golden algae eater smells that algae in there, she's gonna go come out after it. And there's one of my neon stiffron, blue neon stiffron gobies. And right behind it, right there, you can see that's my, right on top of this rock there. Behind that goby is my whiptail catfish. Just hanging out. And um, everything's getting along really well in here. They chase each other around a little bit. The ram is really prettied up, nice with her colors. You can see it there. And uh, the age of fish has already grown since I put it in the tank. And is getting along well. They kind of scoot each other around in here a little bit. There you can see my algae, my golden algae here. She found her bone. So she's gonna protect that and eat off of it and uh, everything's going good in here she's quite a character that golden algae eater I just love her a lot of people when they get these they'll send them back or rehome them uh, they can get a little aggressive I've heard that when they're full grown adults that they can latch on to slower fish and suck the slime coat off of them, harm them, damage them. I haven't seen any of that behavior in here. She'll chase somebody away from her algae tab or out of her cave. That's about it. And uh, they don't even bother this little male angler here. Uh, he's doing fine. And, um, but she is definitely the show of the tank, the golden algae here. She's really thick. That's her cave down here. She's pretty protective of it. And, um, so anyway, I just want to say thanks to my new subscribers and, uh, the encouraging words I've gotten in my comments. I had a little mishap here with some snails I got in that died in my 75 gallon tank. I lost some fish, but uh, everything's fine in there now. So, but everybody has a good day and uh, I'll get back to you again on this tank. The plants are starting to come along okay. This doesn't have dirt in the bottom of it. It's not a, a deep substrate with a soil and a sand cap like in my 75 gallon tank. This is all just has sand in it and some root tabs. This tank has only been up for a few months now. But the plants are starting to come along and uh, I'm pretty happy with this tank so far. So, anyway, everybody have a good day, and uh, I'll get back to you. Thanks. Bye.